Hello everybody, GamerPenny here bringing you another episode of our Thimbleweed Park Let's Play. We are coming back after a Windows 10 uh, malfunction. <laughs> so luckily I was able to save my save game. I thought, <laughs> I thought the worst that we might have to start all over and I'd have to watch the videos and do exactly as I did in the videos to catch up. But I was able to do my, my save games, um, save them on the other hard drive. So we are back here. I... I'm trying to figure out where we left off because it be it has been quite a while. Uh, we're into August and it was maybe July 20th when last we played, I think. Um, so the first thing I want to do is when I was trying to read these to see where we left off, we still have Reyes's notebook. So I want him to actually meet up with her and get his notebook back. Hotel. This is where we're at. Come on. So that when we are on them, they can actually get, um... Evening? To... Hi. They said hi to each other. They can actually get two separate to-do lists. So, give notebook to Reyes. Oh, my notebook. I <laughs> thought I'd lost that for good. These means a lot to me. Thanks. Oh. So let's just take a look at his notebook. See if there's anything different on it. Not really. Okay. The first thing I want to do actually is I want to take care of this Facetron report. Because I think we have everything we need to do that. So we have a picture of the body. Uh, she has the body's passport. So let's give this to him. Thanks. And then he can actually go back to town. I wish there, could we fast travel? <laughs> Is that a thing? Um, I want to go... Edmund Mansion. Abandoned Factory. Trailhead. Old Circus. Radio Station. Hotel. A Street bus station. Oh, 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 oh. Where is the sheriff's office? So this is where the body was. Body cemetery. Sheriff's office would be like right here. So let's go up here. Here? Open? Yes. And we wanted to go up here to do it. Why'd the music get all creepy and weird? Wait, where's Facetron? Downstairs. We don't need a Restron just yet. Go here. Right? Yes. Oh my god, he's gone too. <laughs> that, that I watched back the video of that and that, that it did scare me to death, so. Um, use this. Use this. Impressive, but nothing happened. On here, and use this on here. Is that gonna? This is the identity report I've been waiting for. So we lost the passport and the photo though. Um, so input a photo, government ID, German passport, output, photo identified as suspicious German businessman Boris Schultz. Accuracy 100%. Face drawn, patient, pending, pillowtronics, oh, patent pending. Okay. Get ID. No, get face drawn report. So that's one of the thing, one of the three things we need to get the arrest. Um, so we need to find blood take a blood swab from the body we need to find something to swab it with and then we got we know what this is it's the wallet but we have to get a wallet to replace it with and then we don't know where the murder weapon is find a murder weapon and we need we need tape for the for this okay 
So while he's hanging out here, let's go back to her. We also have the ghost we can be now. And he has some things that... Try to talk to Dolores. Visit Chuck's tomb to get closure. Escape to the afterlife. I'm scared that he's going to go away and we won't be able to do it. So I'm actually going to be her. And we are going to go to a different part of town. Over this way. Country road. And, um, so we're at the hotel. This is where he's at. I mean, let's go, you guys. Old circus. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> what in the world? He's gone crazy. I'm not touching that. <sighs> it's probably cursed, like ransom. Keep your panties on. I'm coming. <laughs> Hi, Whatever Ransom. you're selling, I'm not buying. So take your dime store suit and good news pamphlets and stick them where the sun don't shine. The flashing is awful. Ransom Clown, I heard you know about the body by the bridge. Pizza delivery for Ransom the Clown. <laughs> Some of these fine polyester slides right here. Ransom the Clown? She wouldn't fool I heard around. you know about a body by the bridge. Jeez, no foreplay, Red? You don't beat around the bush, <laughs> do you? Not my style. You can ask your questions, Toots, but I'm not saying I'll answer. Um, what do you know about the bottom of the river? We heard you don't get along with the locals. What do you know about Chuck? Uh, what do you know about what Chuck? What do you know about Chuck? Chuck? As in Chuck? My factory is too good to make <laughs> toys, Edmund? <laughs> Didn't know the pompous <laughs> well myself. But I knew his brother Franklin, weedy guy, total <laughs> scared to stand up to his big brother, even though the family business was in the crapper. How do you know Franklin? How do you know Franklin Edmund? We were supposed to go into business together. My act oh. was about to go bigger than <laughs> Jesus. I was a hit on the Tonight Show. I was on my way to the top, so we figured why not cash in with a little Merchandising. <laughs> Franklin wanted to get the pillow factory into making toys, so it seemed like a good fit. What kind of toys? What kind of toys were you planning to make with Franklin? Jeez, how do you get by in life without brains or beauty? <laughs> Isn't it <laughs> obvious? We were gonna make Ransom the Clown insult dolls. Insult Women dolls? Great if Franklin hadn't bailed on me and gone missing before we signed the contract. He's dead. I could have been rich by now if that little toady <laughs> had grown a backbone. <laughs> okay, um... We heard you don't get along with the locals. Given my creepy clown face and Paul Chant for abusive name calling, Paul it's Chant. not made me a popular community figure. No. But I don't need the validation of these small town losers. <laughs> I'm Ransom the Clown. I was on the Tonight Show. I'm great. Mm-hmm. All right, what about the what body? What do you know about the body by the river? What body? Earlier this evening, we found a body down by the bridge. We're investigating, and I was told you might have some information for me. Nah, I heard some sirens before, but I figured they were headed for the mansion mansion. That's where most of the f***ed up stuff happens. <laughs> what weird stuff do you know about at the mansion? You want to find out about the mansion mansion? You're going to have to talk to some other idiot. I keep to myself and the town folk leave me the f*** alone. Thank <laughs> I'm not about to rock the boat. I don't pay rent here and I can't go anywhere else after my ex-wife took me for everything I had. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back. Whatever, Red. Not like I'm going anywhere, but you're not getting inside without a warrant. Huh. Tickets, 25 cents. It's a rusty old padlock, and it's locked. Okay. So we can't get inside here. All right, so maybe we're not supposed to be here quite yet. So let's go radio station. Okay. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> Come on.
Come on now. Uh, alright. Can we go in? Hi! The feds are watching us. Make no mistake about it. The only way to protect yourself is to fight back. And now back to our special hostile takeover song. <laughs> uh, I want this dust, though. It's a down? music poster. Can I take it? Uh, I can't. It's been glued to the wall. <laughs> Can I talk to you in here? It's locked and bolted from the inside. Walked Impressive mic. Can I take the lava lamp? <laughs> I can't. It's been glued to the desk. Looks like the radio station is on the air. Okay. Alright, let's walk this way then. See if there's something. Oh, Phonetron, huh? It says Phonetron 3000 for when you need to handle hundreds of phone calls. Hmm. Can I use it? There's nothing to use here except maybe that tube. Can I take it? It's stuck. Need a tool. Oh, the radio tower. Oh, we also need a gas for the chainsaw. Hi, can I climb this? Oh god. No way am I climbing that. No way am I climbing that. I'm afraid of what? heights. What? What about R Ray? Is he afraid of heights? Okay, so that's all, all we can do here. I just want to look around. So we know we've got Phonetron at the radio station. We probably have to come back to these a little bit later. Um, let's try this. Wee, been in factory. See what's here. A dust. Pick up a speck of dust. What'd you get over here? Oh my god, the lawn hall. Pick up the dust. Is this from the beginning? For closed by order of safety first. It's a padlock and chain keeping the gate closed. Uh, find mushrooms in the sewers. Go talk to Dolores. Put three reports. Get blood. Get blood. What updated? What updated? Did it just go here? Oh, uh, corner and share for idiots. That's okay. Can work with idiots. They're easy to manipulate. Tron machines are interesting. Glad Ray is with a little eager beaver and took notes. Nothing updated. Why was this blinking? <gasps> oh, we can be him. All right, let me just look over here. Fire factory country road okay um let me I don't know what trailhead is but we're gonna walk down there <laughs> it's a puddle oh that scared me so much <laughs> what is the point of that why is it just like pizza uh can I use this for a little that doesn't seem to work Hi, pizza? Sir? Spooky forest trail, huh? Oh, God. Oh, no. She lost in the forest for good now. Well, the pizza guy went in there. Okay. Spooky forest trail. 
we're here. There's a path this way. Let's walk up there. Walk up here. Go up this way. Hi! Thimbleberries! Can I grab some? Crap. Ow! Ouch! Beep! Damn! Uh... The thorns on that bush are razor sharp. But did we get some? <laughs> no, we didn't. It's a bush with red berries on it. Okay. Up here. Oh, we're back out. This way. Is there anything else to find over there? There's the berries again. It's a bush with red berries on it. Do I have anything? No. Uh, okay. That's where we just came from. Okay. Alright, well let's check out... You. <laughs> uh, ransom the bleepin' clowns to beepin' do list. Get everybody in town to hate me. Check. <laughs> Feed little beeper. Get package at the post office. Try removing makeup again. Get key to factory gate. Ooh. Collect 53 more specks of dust. <gasps> P.S. I hate my life and go beep yourself if you found this note and are reading it. <laughs> well, amazing. Got the refrigerator. Let's open this. Let's pick up the cheese. Pick up the underwear. Always time to do laundry later. Uh, open this. Oh my god. Pick up the hamster. Little well, beeper is pretty vicious. Oh. He'd even bite me if I picked him up. He's probably hungry. Haven't fed him in a few days. Use the cheese on him? Lil Beeper doesn't eat cheese. You think he's a rat or something? He's a hamster! What does he eat? Rotten food? No thanks. Better leave it where it is. <laughs> Get the poster. My old circus poster featured the amazing Ransom the Clown. Pick up the poster. Oh. Uh, open the safe. Pick up the book. Joke book. What's this? Walk to pa Pick up the page. I feel like we're gonna come back here. Hey, stop! Oh, what's happening? Where's it going? Damn broken window. Find missing joke book page. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, can I pick up these trophies? I glued them to the table so no one could steal <laughs> them back when I thought they were real gold. After 10 years, looks like it worked. Pick up the comic book? Ransom the clown. 25. Buy my beeping book. <laughs> That's a rare first edition of my fantastic comic book. Use the bed? It's nowhere near my bedtime. Use the mirror? What a f still doesn't work! Ah. Aww. Well, at least I f tried. That was on our to-do list, right? Try and remake him again, yep. Uh, get key to factory gate, feed little beeper, get package at the post office, and find the page. Can we go out here? I think that's everything in here. <laughs> Can I use this trampoline? That's too far to jump from here. Oh, we'll go down here. I need to be higher to jump on it. Uh. I need to be higher to jump on it. 
That's too far to jump what? from here. <laughs> okay. Go to circus grounds. Is this popcorn? I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, <laughs> inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Is this dust? Pick up the dust. If you can't put it in something. Uh pick up this popcorn bag. I don't want to pick that up. Why? That doesn't seem to work. <laughs> That's where the midway used to be. Now it's my garbage dump. Okay. Oh hi. You want some cheese? I can't. I can't give it to him. Uh, alright. What's in this doorway? Anything? Hi, can you go over there, please? I can't get there from here. There's another way. I can't, I can't get there from oh, here. My God. There's another way. Oh. Pick up this dust. He grabbed popcorn. That rat is stealing all the popcorn and we need to feed it to our hamster, probably. All right, well, it's over here. I can't leave the circus till I feed Lil Beeper. I won't pick up some greasy, disgusting, inedible piece of popcorn if I can't put it in something. Okay, but I, I just looked at this. Let's look at the stand. It's empty. The rats and I cleaned it out years ago. Look at the bag. It's an empty popcorn bag. Pick up the bag. Okay, okay, okay. Um, pick up this. Well, that's one. Lil Beeper loves this crap. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, two. I can count. Am I really gonna pick up all this? <laughs> Rats having more fun at this than I am. <laughs> yeah, Not we gotta pick it up before half, the rat. Almost half. Full. Get out of here, rat. Half full now. No. This is taking two. At this rate, it'll be no. 1988. Rat beat me to it. This is gonna take forever there's gotta be a better way half full popcorn excuse me rat you took all the popcorn walk to the hole look at the hole hi rat i'll trade i'll trade you this moldy cheese for that like popcorn use the cheese on the hole up to popcorn. There's gotta be a better way. Use the hole? I can't. Is this full? Half half full. Well the rat's not going to get the popcorn. So he dropped his popcorn. Is he following me? It better not be. Alright, let's go try to give this bag of popcorn to this hamster. And then we'll go ahead and end the episode there. Use this on here. That's not gonna be enough for a little beef. What? How do we get the other stuff back? The rat ate the popcorn. That's where the midway used to be. Now it's. I can't open that. Hi. Um, I need all that popcorn that you took. Oh, yes. <laughs> Pick up this. It's a full bag of popcorn. All right. Now we'll go give it to the little guy and then we'll end this episode now. Uh, after he eats that popcorn. <laughs> this is such a weird... <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I love this game so much. <laughs> All right, use this popcorn on the Here you go, little beeper. Enjoy your crap. <laughs> Free little beeper. Now he can leave. He can leave town, leave the circus. So, okay. Well, that is going to be where we end the episode. So, guys, I want to. 
can you face the camera? No. <laughs> um, I want to thank you so much for your support on this series. If you do want to see more of the Thimbleweed Park Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Alright, bye everyone!